I'm Alicia Malone from Turner Classic Movies, joined by eTalk's Tracy Melshaw. Hey, hey, Alicia. It's day two of the Toronto International Film Festival for another great film. It is the world premiere of Butcher's Crossing. Nicholas Cage is right there, so it is quite loud. But before we get into it, we'd like to acknowledge where this event is taking place tonight. This is the treaty territory of the Mississaugas of the Credit First Nation and the traditional territory of the Haudenosaunee, Anishinaabe and Huron-Wendat. The territory is within the lands protected by the Dish with One Spoon Wampum Belt Covenant and is home to many First Nations, Inuit and Métis people. We are so proud and grateful to have the opportunity to highlight and celebrate Indigenous filmmakers here at hey, TIFF, both at the festival, and doing? there is a man of the hour, Mr. <laughs> Nicholas Cage. How are you? Happy to be here. Very good. I'm very happy to be here. Welcome back to TIFF. Thank you so much. How good is this your first again. Western? Well, well, it's, 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 well, exactly, right? Well, well, you know, the thing is, it's the first time I've made a movie in this part of the world in Montana in that time period, so it's kind of a Western, but the director would say it's not really a Western. But uh, in any event, it's, it's kind of great for me to be here at Toronto International Film Festival for a movie that actually screens at 9.30 and not midnight. I'm normally here for the midnight <laughs> yeah, movie. I know. This is the first for me. Because you always surprise us with your Thank film you. roles and Thank your performances. You. What you. do you look for when you come to reading a script? I just never want to be comfortable with what I'm doing. I want to stay challenged. I want to look for something new, and every time I, I go out there and and make a movie, I want to find a character where I hopefully, because I see myself very much as a student of film performance, I, I will learn something in the process. So I keep trying to challenge myself. Still learn? I, I'm still learning, very wow. much so. <laughs> Your character Miller is on a harrowing journey, so what was the challenge like filming that in real life? Well, it was a very difficult character to try to make sympathetic at all, because what he's doing is really very serious, it's very atrocious. Um, we're talking about the the, uh, the, really the almost the slaughter of the American buffalo to extinction. That's a heavy subject matter. And I'm, but uh, again, you never, when you play a character that's that disturbing, you, you don't want to look at the person as the villain per se. You want to see what's in the personality that's also human, that someone can understand how things can go that far wrong. So that's, that's the challenge for the character like this guy, Miller. I know you have to go, but before we let you go, do you have a favorite Nicolas Cage movie? That's what we're asking everyone today. Wow, a favorite Nicolas Cage <laughs> movie. Performance. Oh, uh, wow. Uh, well, I really was really happy with Pig. I really liked that oh, movie, yes. and I liked that character of Rob, so I really liked that. But they're all my children, so I hesitate to say I prefer one over the other. I don't want one to get jealous, you know what I mean? Exactly. So, but yeah, I, I like Pig a lot. We'll have fun tonight. Thank Thanks Thank for you. talking. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> the legend himself, Nicolas Cage.